camera. Action. Bit of bad news. The next big game for the blog was... England, Italy. England, so. Italy. So, that might not be happening. Yeah, we were looking, We got tickets basically to England, Denmark at Wembley on the... No. Do we have tickets to England, Denmark? We've got, definitely oh, got tickets to England, Denmark. Um, okay. We've also got tickets to England, Italy, both taking place in a few days of each other. Not entirely clear whether they're going to be taking place. The latest coronavirus situation, we've been forced to... <laughs> stack up on the beer. Stack up on the beer. Uh, quick plug though, Belgian beer in a box, excellent service. Fair enough, I don't know, I don't know they were, but... Yeah, so we, we're going to be staying at this brewery in the summer, St Bernard's Wattel, it's near the um, war stuff, um, which went on there, so... I mean, I've been there before, but... You have been there before? I've been there before. So Mark's going to be showing us around, and we're staying at the brewery... They're going to do a little bit of a tour. We're going to a couple of other places. We're actually going to be making a special beer order from a monastery, which we're going to go to um, somewhere else. Um, it's going to be quite exciting. Um, the reason it's quite exciting in Belgium because we wanted to discuss the... Hello. We, we've got... No, yeah, we've go. got friends arriving. Um, so West has turned up. Um, we wanted to discuss the Euro draw, the Euro Nations League draw, because we got tickets for the Euros, so and we're not sure where that's going to be taking place. Yeah. And the Euro Nations is next summer, so the draw, I think we're in Group A, England. England, yeah. Here we got. Uh, got Belgium in our group. Yeah, Belgium. We were, we have been discussing the possibility of an away trip somewhere, which we've never been before. What, Iceland? Iceland, yeah. So yeah. We think we can get tickets, but I think the capacity of the ground is only going to take 5,000 England fans. Might involve a Friday night flight to Reykjavik. Sounds a bit tricky, but... There's not much to do, though. Not, yeah. Um, we fancy the trip to the King Bedouin Stadium, or whatever it's called. Yeah. I think it's basically the old Heysel Stadium. Um, that's in November. And the other team in the group, Denmark. So it'll be the, the friendly in a few weeks will be give us an indication of that. So not sure where the finals are going to be. Which it's like decided out of the last four teams, isn't it? Yeah, so the winners of each group. Mark, it's Portugal, are they? What's their chances? <laughs> Very slim, they with France in the group. Could be a tough one. Um, it'd be interesting to see what our Portuguese friends think about this one. Um, great result for Rio Ave the other day. Um, Porto 1 1. Maddy scored, didn't he? We saw some crazy videos from the lads, so I hope you enjoyed that game and. Uh, Hopefully all this craziness with the virus doesn't stop any trips. No, we've got tickets for the Euros, so hopefully it's uh, dying down by then. Anyway, a uh, quick review of one of our beers. So we haven't we haven't cracked these open yet, but the 12% is highly recommended. Uh, we've, uh, 12%? Quick, yes, good one. Quick review of the, I've not tried this one before, Capital Watto. What's the what's it say about it, Mark? <laughs> I actually can't read. Well, I can't read. It's in Belgium, isn't it? I mean, no, it's not Belgium. It's Belgium language. No, it's French. Flemish, I think. Flemish, I believe, is the language. I'm French. Maybe they do speak French. I think it's French. <laughs> anyway, I can't speak French. This is quite a nice one. I did try the the Castel Donker one the other night, which was pretty nice. I did try another one last night, which wasn't quite so good. But what are you giving it out of Um. It's definitely not as nice as the Castel Donka one, which was really nice. I would give that one a 9 out of 10. This is... Um, it's kind of got a slight caramelly flavour in. What's the percentage? Um, 10%. 10%? doesn't taste 10%. It's a triple. Speaking. A load of gibberish to me. But. I'm going to go for a seven percent, and it's clearly seven, now seven, <laughs> seven. Sorry, seven, seven out, out of ten. ten. And clearly, it's now time to say, Arriva Dirty. It's one on one. Ah!